Hi Aries, welcome to the love read. So I'm doing a separate love read for you. I hope you're okay with that and I hope it's not too confusing for you to watch the daily and then watch the love read. Um, but I feel like the love read can bring clarity. <laughs> so let's see what we have here. I'm using daily guidance from the angels with by Dorian Virtue. Assertiveness. The situation can be healed gently and with love. Be strong and truthful. Okay. Sounds good. Okay, so I'm going to do a you versus them. See what comes up in the energies for Aries and their person. In love. In love and relationships. In love and relationships. Okay, please show us Aries energy right now. Please show us Aries energy with their person. Please show us Aries energy. Chariot. You're not looking back. You're very determined. You could be desiring to travel somewhere as well. To get in the car and go somewhere. You see the situation or there's an opportunity for something new. This is the same as the daily. You come out as Pisces imagination. Opportunities, confusion, Scorpio, Venus Scorpio. So Venus is about pleasure, Scorpio is about the soul and secrets hidden. Um, you have lots of choices or you could be imagining or daydreaming. You could be putting something together. What's your person's energy? Aries love, Aries love. They're strong, they're fiery, um, they're in charge. <laughs> oh wow, they see the situation with you as good, as stable. I could see this too as you want to go out and they want to stay home. They like being at home with you, maybe sitting outside in the backyard. <laughs> and you want to go out. You're like, I want to go out. They are... They've got ideas. They've got ideas. They're solving problems. They're solving something. Or they're, they've, they're inspired. What's the issue? They're solving a problem possibly for you if you're confused. What here is between Aries and their person? Ah, father, father figure, emperor, Aries in, in charge, power, personal power, wanting to be the boss. I think Aries, like there could be a lot that you want to do. There's a lot you want to do. And you're like, I'm going. And Ace of Coin, you may be paying the other person is in a fiery king. So they will do it. They've got energy, but they they see the situation as let's stay home. I'll make something great happen here. <laughs> You're the emperor. What is the emperor? My way or the highway? Sometimes. Oh, wow. Ten of coin. There's a lot of money involved. There could be saving money. Stable wealth commitments okay commitments to family and friends what what's aries energy here with the seven of cups why is it here why do we have neptune influencing aries so much Ooh. okay 
something was painful. There was painful information you received, and I don't feel like it's from them. What is Aries person here providing to Aries? Okay. Um, high Priestess. Intuition, or they're being quiet. They kind of know. They could have a, a sense of knowing. Uh, it did come out here with judgment. <laughs> Resurrection. There's also a seven of swords underlying. Somebody is wearing a false mask. They're not telling the truth. I don't think it's your person. It's resurrection, a rebirth. Something isn't over or something's coming back up. It's major beginnings, new beginnings. Um, what is the Three of Swords for Aries? What is this uh, judgment calling? Day of reckoning. Hierophant. Okay. Something about an institution. Institutional values. Um, following order. Doing what you need to do. Receiving, it could be marriage issues. It could be receiving information from someone or from some business. What is the high priestess here? What is the high priestess? There's someone here who feels entitled. There is a, a nine of swords. There's a lot of worry or concern. Okay, what is the judgment about between Aries and their person? Okay, there's a judgment about change, and there's also a judgment about truth. News, information. Other people who are in a group, um, tightly knit, Okay, this could be something where you, you're left out of a situation because you're separated, you're left out of something. Um, but there is an ace of coin that you see the situation. Oh, wow, okay, hair friend, two of cups, marriage, partner, or there's some partner. What is this partner doing? <laughs> Show us the partnership. Justice. Okay. Justice. And it came up with a 10 of the water. There's a strong bond between people. There can be family situations. King of the air is here. Somebody could be directing, giving information. Queen of the air. Page of the air, wow. Queen of the water, intuition, or Pisces, water sign, and something disruptive with the world. Okay. Hangman, hey something's on pause. So your person over here, the person you're dealing with, is feeling kind of bad. You have healing. What's this Ace of Swords coming up between Aries and their person? What is this news or information? See, it came up the Seven of Swords. So you're getting information about a lie, something that was hidden, or something that is, you know, someone who is either keeping something quiet. And what is this Wheel of Fortune starting to turn with the Judgment? King of the Water, Pisces, Cancer, Scorpio. Someone with a lot of compassion. What is Ten of Cups? Wait, think, feeling like you're getting nothing in return. Ace of Coins here. Injustice. This could be money as well. You're getting the truth about something where someone was lying. What is um, Aries person with the magician? What are they fixing? King of the air and queen of the air. Two. There's two intellectual energies. Um, two smart people. 
and you get truth. So what is, um, okay, what is Aries' friend here as the King of Wands doing? Why are they in a Nine of Swords? Like, they're in a Nine of Swords over here. What is the Five of Swords about? Five of Swords. So, it's showing Five of Swords to the Nine of Swords. What did what happened here for your person? What did they do? What did they say? They feel entitled and yet they're stressing out. There's a lie that becomes clear. Hairpin, something about the institution of marriage or um, operations, government sometimes. What is Seven of Cups? Okay, it's something about a friend, sibling, loved one. Queen of Water comes forward with that. What is the energy here? Strength. Needing to be strong, drawing upon your inner strength. What is the Ace of Swords? What is this clarity? Okay, Knight of Cups. You get some information. Um, sips of Air. Somebody coming back around. Why is this person so stressed out? What is the Nine of Swords about? Okay, it could be something about money. Page of Coin. Ten of coin. Page of coin, ten of coin. They could be stressing about money. And bottom of the deck is a ten of cups. It could be a friend or family member. Someone is very exhausted, very tired. Come here, please. Goodness. So I'm going to use the Psychic Tarot deck by John Holland and pull a few messages to see what's going on with Aries and their person. You're getting the truth about something to do with, um, now you as the chariot, you could be moving forward to help someone because we have a spiritual union here. Um, what do we have here? Why is Aries person stressing out so badly? It can be about a commitment, but it could also be about money, finances. Um, maybe someone you know got an unexpected bill. What is going on here with Aries and the, their person in this situation? I got like a hangman energy with the waiting game. Foundation and Achievement, Four of Wands. And I got here a partnership and an alliance. Giving someone help or helping them out. Show us the outcome or what is between. I know there was Aries as the boss or an emperor. Someone running an empire. So I got the new beginnings with the fool. I got the transformation, which is the death. The fool and the death. There's a new beginning. Some kind of new beginning. And I got material, will, and wealth and prosperity. And I also got, wow, triumph, destiny. And I also got the ten of cups destiny here. Ten of cups. My goodness. Recognition and reward is on the bottom. Somebody could be um, upset around you who feels distressed. Um, if you're getting something like promotions or something like that, I don't know why that would be. But it's almost like the sense of entitlement. Um, but there, it's mixed with great fear. And the energy between you was emperor. Which to me is 
personal power, authority. Um, there was a challenge with the Ten of Coin. There's more money, more wealth. Um, your energy is chariot. You're very determined to move ahead. There is an ace of coin here. There could be a new job you're receiving. The outcome, though, is there's a lot to consider. There's a lot to think about. And your person is in magician, which is they're fixing, they're repairing, they're solving problems. Um, they are in a very assertive energy. Like they're, they're taking charge, they're fixing problems, they're putting things together. So I'll leave this here for you, Aries. This is an interesting reading for your love life. Um, I will leave this here. Thank you and take care.